Hey guys, I'm Johnny and welcome back to Johnny's Kingdom. This is episode 10 and today I'm going to be working on a marketplace and look at all my sheepies and animals. And <laughs> let's change back into, uh, I was in the right mode, new press F1. Alright, so basically I just wanted to show you that I got all my sheep and yeah, I do, I had to come by with one down there. Cause, um, yeah, and I'm going to do this um, on the gap between each one. I don't really know why I want water here, just for, just colors really, and so it's an infinite water source. So yeah, and then the chest, pretty much the two on each side of each stable will be for the animal that's inside the stable. So at the moment these ones don't have any one, but these will be all different colored. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to do that, and as you can see I've got all, all of my Dies, yeah, that's the word, <laughs> I was at a struggle finding the word. And um, yeah, I'm going to do these all the way along, and I'm going to put signs all the way along, and dye my sheep, and I'll be back once I've done that. See you in a sec. Alright guys, so here I am back at my stables, and I'll just do a quick rundown as um, I talk. So yeah, cows, chickens, and then all the sheep. So, got. so I sheared them all once, as you see if I looked in the chest, you'd see all the colours, and they've all regrown their wool. It's very efficient, I've got to say, that, um, because if I want to, say, get wool, if I run down and shear them all, and then get all their wool, and by the time I've gone all the way around doing that, they'll pretty much all have their wool back, which is pretty cool. So it's like, if I want it to, I can pretty much have it never ending, which is awesome. So yeah, I'm going to be doing that a fair bit, hopefully offline, to get myself stacks and stacks of coloured wool. It's very good. Um, efficient as well. Um, this is what I did at the end of the nether episode, um, where I said I was going to come back, but then, yeah, the audio stuffed up when I went to edit it, and I don't know what's wrong with that. I think it's because the longer I record for, the more it stuffs up, so I've got to try and keep my episodes as, um, short as I can, and because I went to get, um, cactus for, I don't know why I did that, to, for the sheep, um, I just thought I'd make a cactus farm there. And then I recorded on Friday, but I turned my sound up because I thought my talking was too quiet compared to the game noises, but yeah, and in that episode I made this styled house thing, and I quite like it. I think that's cool for a little medieval house. Uh, it's my own design. I made in creative mode, and yeah, I chucked into my world when I built it on Friday. That was weird. <laughs> anyway, today... Um, I thought it would be cool if, I'm thinking that from here and here, we have like a little wall, a wall not as tall as the outside wall, but like a backup wall kind of, around the stop, the docks to, actually I don't know if I want to do that, but anyway, basically, um, I'm going to build like, there's going to be, this is going to be like a marketplace, centre place, so, it's going to be like a town square, like a marketplace middle here, and then there's going to be shops around the circle and maybe some in the middle. I'm not too sure, but that's basically what I'm going to do for this episode. Um, so I clear out some of this dirt. Um, yeah, so that's been going on lately. The video has been going weird. Um, and yeah, I'm not really sure what's been happening with them. But on some good news, uh, I don't really know what happened, but I was playing around with uploading videos to try and get it all right again. And um, I realised when I just, because I upload like 20 second videos, not even that, of me just testing out different screen or volume like settings. Just set it to private so no one can see. But anyway, um, I realised it said, in the thumbnails it said, customise thumbnail. And I was like, um, okay. So I had a look at it, and I can have my own customized thumbnails now, which is cool, and I'm, I'm not sure why, because I'm not a partner or anything like that. Um, I'm just, I don't get paid for any of this or whatever, I'm not a partner, I don't get like a banner or anything, I just, I think it might have actually been a mistake, and I'm not too sure what's going on, but I'm um, kind of glad that it's a mistake, because it's really cool. And, um, I made a thumbnail for this kingdom, uh, videos, and they're on the videos at the moment, hope you like it, because I thought it was alright for a thumbnail, 
and yeah, <laughs> that's pretty cool. And uh, yeah, so um, I was actually talking to this guy, um, and he's a artist kind of thing. Uh, he makes like Minecraft avatars and YouTube backgrounds and stuff, and um, it was all for free, which is I think is really cool. And I asked him if he could do me some, and he's like, "Yeah, sure, that'd be awesome." And um, yeah, his name's um, he well he's used the name he goes by the name Cat or Caterpillar in Corp Inc. I think it is. I'm not too sure. Um, I'm gonna put his channel and. He, he has two channels, he has his art channel and he has his actual channel. I'm going to put both of them in the description and also his art page, which is from Planet Minecraft. Um, you guys should all go check it out, it's really cool. He's a pretty good artist and yeah, I just think you guys should all just, just get behind him, he's a really cool guy. Um, I was talking to him the other day, um, been playing on server with him because all my topics have rolled into each other it's been really cool <laughs> um yeah so i was looking for him because i'd sent him a message and he hadn't got back to me and he, he said if um he doesn't get back within two weeks try again so i did and i realized he'd opened damn it, i need a new shovel i realized he'd opened his own server up and i thought hey that might be a good opportunity to go find him um and talk to him about it and sure enough he was on and I've been playing that server and I'm gonna be right back alright so I'm back um, <laughs> went and made some more shovels and I've just marked this out here and basically what I was saying was I was on this server um, playing this guy's server um, it's 24-7 so no matter where you are in the world you can play it and basically what I wanted to say was I'm probably gonna play that a fair bit when I'm not doing anything else I'm just playing for fun I'll probably be playing that server I really like it it's just a cool server so if you guys want to get on and play with me on the server just for fun um I'll put the uh, IP and <laughs> that was weird IP in the description and you can just come along and um just if I'm on by any chance um just say hey Johnny what's going on um where are you? And I'll like come lead you because I'm thinking of making my house into like a hotel area kind of thing, so I could build like your room or a house like off my house, which would be kind of cool. But anyway, that's all I really wanted to say about that. And um, speed up. Alright, um, it's pretty speedy there. Um, <laughs> yeah, so I thought I'd speed that up. I'm not sure if you guys like that or not. If you don't, um, just tell me and I'll stop doing it. Um, I just thought that'd be interesting to do kind of thing because, um, yeah, it's easier than cutting kind of, not really at all, but yeah. <laughs> Alright, so. Basically, I'm going to make this weird oval shape um, area. Um, I'm going to run out of stone brick, probably, but that's okay. But, uh, yeah, so basically, because now I have all this wall that I can get, which is awesome in every colour, um, I'm going to make, like, little shops. They won't even be shops. They'll be, like, not even very big, like, maybe, like, 4x4 four four max the size that's what I mean like and they'll just be like little stalls that have like sell different things for example like fruit or fish or bread or something and then that comes right out of the docks which is cool I think and they will be different colors and they'll have like um, different colored fabric material on the tops of them which I think will look pretty cool and then that will lead out of like this entrance exit here um, probably build another house here and then have a road down the middle and then the back, back of the house will be like on the edge of the marketplace and then people will build their stalls on the outside but anyway 
yeah, you exit out here or something, and then you come down this road, and yeah, I think that'd be cool. And yeah, that's basically what I have um, for this setup at the moment. It's a weird oval, isn't it? <laughs> um, Alright, so I'm just going to run back to my house um, quickly, and this will probably be the end of the episode. Um, sorry, it wasn't really that productive. I did a little bit on that, but not really too much. Um, basically, kind of just an update video, letting you guys what, know what's been going on, and what I hope to do f over the next couple of episodes or so. Oh, let's chuck all this dirt in here. I'm going to have to move all this down. Um, and, man, I am all over the place. Yeah, so that's pretty much um, what I had to say. And I just want to say... Because I did this in a video, but then I deleted that or whatever. And the new achievements I got since a couple of episodes ago is um, Stuart, which is pretty much the guy that commented all these, uh, asked me to make a small nether castle, um, which is pretty cool, I think. And I've left one for myself, so I remember, because I get all these ideas and I just forget them. So I thought I might as well mark them down. And, yeah, so I'm going to build a blacksmith as well. I've got to remember to do that. And uh, I want you guys to feel free to leave your... What is going on? <laughs> feel free to leave your own ideas for what you want to see in my um, kingdoms area and what you want to see in this series. And uh, um, I'd like to thank you all for watching. Uh, please leave a like or comment if you enjoyed. And I'll see you all next time. Johnny out.